Today we are out here at Harcourt, the brand new bike park facility just shy of Bendigo. We're out with the full crew. We've caught up with Marlon out here to take us through some of the trails. Marlon, what are we expecting out here today? Uh, so we've got a huge variety of trails out here. Mainly we've got two sides. One is kind of man-made and flowy with jumps and berms and the other side's a lot more technical and natural. So Marlon, we've just come up the climbing trail of number two and we're about to hit the down trail section. What can we expect from this trail? This is the main jump trail in the park, which it's full of jumps and berms and it should be a lot of fun. Yeah, awesome. Oh, they're already gone, let's go. Man, these northern side trails are so smooth and flowy. What else you got going on around here? There's some super techie stuff on the southern side, so who wants to hit that up? Nice, well, you take Benny over there. Me and Brando, we're gonna hit up some more flowy stuff. Sounds good. Let's go. <laughs> Those climbs have some definite sting in their tail. They're long and they're technical. Super gratifying when you get to the top though. Yeah, well we've now got an awesome trail to get down with. So this one's pretty fast and pretty rocky. And Is there anything I need to watch out for? Uh, yeah, there's a few uh, steep chutes in it and um, it's probably the hardest trail in the park. Okay, so we're going down slippery, wet granite chutes. Yeah, that's it. Should and this fine. is track eight, so. Track eight, all right. Should be track 666. So what do you think of that? That was technical, man. Some of that stuff was equally as technical as anything I've ridden at Derby or Buller, even more so even. It definitely took me to my limit. You look pretty comfortable though. Yeah, it's good fun. <laughs> Go and check out what the other boys are doing. Yeah, sounds good. Cool.
<laughs> hey man, good riding today. How'd you find the flow trails? They were awesome. We've been having a ball up there and we're just absolutely wrapped that there's such a park like this now in uh, just outside of Melbourne. Like what is it, an hour and a half drive out of Melbourne? Yeah, something like that. This is just, it's a place you've got to get to. There's so much going on here and we're absolutely wrapped and privileged to have you out here showing us around. So thank you very much, mate. Yeah, no worries We're going to get all. out of here now, guys. We're going to go load up the cars and drive on home.